thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I have um, noticed your communication. There was a meeting truly as uh, you have captured in your communication yesterday where we were invited. And the speaker, if my memory serves me right, uh, not all the members of Jubilee were in the meeting. But be that as it may, we'll be requesting your office, Mr. Speaker, to put the documentation that company that you said is attached, which is the minutes to the letter of the majority leader, because in the past, Mr. Speaker, uh, uh, a similar process had been followed on the majority side. I know in the case of Senator Wetangula, you gave a detailed ruling with uh, clear information. In the case, the past case of uh, majority side, you said you are still to give your ruling, which we are patiently waiting, Mr. Speaker. Um, from May last year, this is uh, February 2021. I, we are still praying that you may make your ruling before August 2022. Uh, but we would like to request your office to put the information, uh, the details, Mr. Speaker, uh, at the dispatch box there so that we can all, uh, Mr. Speaker, access. Number two, uh, I like, I, I don't see Senator Kangata here, but I'd like to congratulate uh, Senator Kangata for having served the, in the Senate. Uh, for the last uh, uh, less than one year, eight months or thereabout, as the majority whip. Um, Mr. Speaker, we know Senator Kangata came in in circumstances that many of us do not agree with, but Mr. Speaker, we, he has uh, done his job on behalf of those who asked him to do it uh, with a lot of passion, but now he's wiser, um, Mr. Speaker. He has realized that no matter how much you work for these people, uh, Mr. Speaker, and particularly when you are doing the wrong thing. Um, Mr. Speaker, it will never <laughs> lead to any reward. Uh, we had a very, a lot of altercation with Senator Kangata in these chambers in the Division of Revenue Debate, among others. But Mr. Speaker, I am a Democrat. I'm a person who believes in uh, Mr. Speaker doing things right. And it doesn't matter that it was done wrong for me. I still believe that uh, Senator Kangata should have been treated differently. Uh, he should have been given fair hearing. He should have, Mr. Speaker, Jubilee side should have entertained Mr. Speaker alternative view, particularly when you are talking about a matter that is so important as BBI, or as we are told is an important matter that is supposed to build bridges. Mr. Speaker, Senator uh, Wamatang, who is coming in, is my friend. When I went to get myself a wife, uh, Mr. Speaker, and uh, to negotiate uh, dowry, it was Senator Kangata, uh, Wamatangi was on the other side with the elders, uh, and he harassed me, Mr. Speaker. He really harassed me <laughs> at that time. Both of us were not senators. Uh, later, we were lucky to come here together in 2013 as uh, senators. We've been good friends. Senator Wamatangi has been a very... Senator Wamatangi has been a very measured man in his utterances and performance and actions. He comes from a county that is largely a hustler nation in Kiambu County. I want to give him just a small piece of advice, although I'm not that qualified considering his past role, uh, that Mr. Speaker, he must uh, treat all of us, particularly on the majority side, fairly and equally. He must also measure his words and utterances, Mr. Speaker. He must share opportunities. Uh, I don't want to give the details of those opportunities on this side, Mr. Speaker, uh, fairly. But most importantly, he must now realize that antagonism doesn't pay and find a way of ensuring that Jubilee is more united. We do not want to come back here with those nonsense of respect the president and disrespect the deputy president. Or, Mr. Speaker, this idea that you insult senators and tell them, you know, because you are criticizing a policy of government that is against the devolution, you start telling people they are going to be dewipped or be removed. He not prosecute any senator, like Angata did prosecute five senators, Mr. Speaker, in the last uh, term. And so I ask Senator Kangata to, uh, to work so carefully because this, is, uh, this can easily turn to be a hanging rope, uh, particularly in your political career, because you are taking position at a time that is uh, insinuated, can easily be understood to mean you are going against the popular view of your people in Kiambu. I want you to be re-elected again. 
Please tread carefully. Work with Hustler Nation, and your future is secured. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.